One mathematician by the name of Ian Stewart claimed, The mental universe of mathematics has provided human beings with many of their deepest insights into the world around them. Stewart also believed in the unreal reality of mathematics, but ordinary people like us, we think it sounds like a bit of a mystery. So today, let's get ready to dig deep as we begin with the thing that started it all, pattern. The first thing we need to know is that there are two types of patterns, numeric patterns and geometric patterns. Little did we know that the evolution of our understanding of such patterns allowed us to increase our pursuits in understanding even the slightest detail in the universe. Look around and try to see the patterns not quite hidden in nature. Aren't they all worthy of appreciation? Cloud formation, petals of flowers, branches of trees, they are truly a work of art and of course of mathematics. Do you know what makes patterns look so perfect? Well, I'll take you in on one secret. It's because of one of the biggest breakthroughs as far as geometric patterns are concerned, the golden ratio. Golden ratio may also be known as golden mean, whereas the ratio of two quantities is equal to the sum to the larger of the two quantities. It is a special number approximately 1.618. However, some artists and architects believe the golden ratio makes the most pleasing and beautiful shape. For instance, Many buildings and artworks have the golden ratio in them, such as the Parthenon in Greece, the pyramids in Egypt, Leonardo da Vinci's Mona Lisa. The universe is composed of countless of patterns, each superficially hiding a mystery. As inhabitants of Earth, our minds are continuously challenged by the patterns in the natural world. With these challenges, we can better understand and use such patterns for the preservation and development of life. It is the oneness of vision, cognition, and locomotion as the design of the movement of all animals on earth. The phenomenon of the golden ratio contributes to understanding the idea that pattern and diversity coexist as integral necessary features of the evolutionary design of the nature.